both sides. Yeah. Little park from on the dummy. Yeah, As you can see, when you ain't got a partner, you can practice on the dummy. Pucks are safe. Now this is pup so from look so how you see different variations of puck. And you see if you stay stick it to gill with a puck and free punch. The other side, change the other side, change. Good, so we always pressure on both sides, everything we do. And you can see clearly. Like I said, this drill is done with control. It's Fiona hit Gil really hard, she won't have no one to practice with. So, she's got to do everything with control. Regardless, she's just a woman. Close shot, very close shot, so you can see the position of Fiona's hands. Check them all the time. Raising the puck, so, when Gil will, Fiona will open and puck again. She will open. Now you see? Good. These are different variations. These are all movement we practice. The other side. This is what we call three step punching, teaching your body to correspond your bottom and top section at the same time. Punching and stepping at the same time, so therefore teach you confidence to go forward and also confidence to go backwards and attack at the same time. So you can see Gil and Fiona. Like I said, no one's trying to, to run each other over, just correspond to each other as a drill. So if you cannot step, how can you attack? And you cannot step back forward, it's something bigger than you. How can you defend yourself? How you see this drill? This is three step punching with laps down now. How you see the difference now? That means when you punch somebody in a two strong, go backwards, then pull, and then punch at the same time, then carry on punching again. Wing Chun consists of many movements. And not just punching, you've got pull, you've got puck, you've got jump, you've got yun, circle hand, you've got gum. As you can see, some people are showing today. But like I said, most important thing is both of them correspond to each other, not to knock each other out, just to play in harmony. This we call fat though in the palm. This is uh, there to take the force, one side, and palm at the same time, so you can see. It's also part of the uh, serum towel, the fat hand. Yeah. Also, if you're going to do free punch afterwards, you want to. Now you see, it's like a puzzle, all the techniques go together. exercise. Just from the CM towel, learn how to use the technique to go out and come in. This is the first stage. Fats again on a dummy, come to honest. Now you see. So like everything we do, we do with a partner, by yourself, and also on a dummy. So the three stages of practicing. Sometimes you haven't got a partner, so you do the dummy. And some you've got a partner, uh, you might get used to him and don't practice by yourself. Then you've got to learn to practice by yourself, so self-improve. But the most important thing is about positioning, calm, calmness in your movement, and trusting the movement at the same time. Same thing now, there's definitely sticky, fa, chop, free punch. As you can see, different variation of gorso, sticky, dummy, by yourself, so we don't waste nothing at all. Everything we practice on both sides. Now you see. Called your moves in movements. Only drills, all drills, Wing Chun drills, we practice in. How you see Fiona and Gil? Gil is feeding Fiona to practice movement. And you see different variations of movement punching, look so, into look so.
So you see Luxo, they're going to start Luxo now, he's playing some movements, as you see clearly. So they incorporate uh, movements, gorso, sticky, this is a little play, light play, to bring out techniques. Nice. Gang so, go to the variation of movements. You can see little movement, all technical. But if you're a woman, she can't do strips, she's got to do spoon technique. You got it right? Yeah, run in, yeah, go. This is a chain from M2. Look, go so into sticky. Sticky means cross hands. See different movement practicing, see uh, how body, the body can react to movements. Good, into go to gung -so. Good. Good. Now you see movement coming out with Fiona. And the girl put his hand in position, she just goes and find the right, right, right technique to use. This exercise, you have no time to think, you just got to know your drills really well and movements, and you can do your movements. If you pause, you get hit. So it's teaching you to react really quickly with losing techniques. <laughs>